What up fam, Real Spartan here and we're back for part 10. We're gonna be going straight to our uncle to see what he can tell us. We needed some advice apparently, so we're gonna see what that's about. But in the meantime, I do want to say once again, thank you to everybody that is watching this, that's kind of supporting me, going through the journey with me. Uh, this is, again, not going to be the only play that I'm doing, so i um, huge PlayStation fan, huge story, solo kind of campaign type of person, so I'll be uploading a lot more of this. Um, if you like the content and you want to stay up to date, go ahead and like, go ahead and subscribe. It really, really helps, so that is it. So let's get right into it. She meet Uncle Aaron at the docks. Hi, Miles. Spill it. Give me the whole situation. Finn, rocks on, underground. It's just a lot, you know? You're 17. You're stressed. And you're a superhero. You gotta cut yourself some slack. You still making beats? And not much since I started this. Work-life balance, kid. Most important thing. Here little project your dad and I started back in the day. A mixtape. Had rhymes ready and everything. <laughs> How come I never heard about this? Because we never finished. We sampled street noise around the way. Wanted the city to be our beat. But your dad had the masters. And after things went bad between us... <sighs> but you can finish what we couldn't. Plus, it'll take your mind off work. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, what do I do? Load that up. I'll walk you through it. I set up holograms to guide you. Scan the source. Holograms, huh? Okay, don't think about Finn. Focus on sounds. Clear my head. Scan the holograms, and it'll unlock files on that drive I gave you. Help you figure out which sound you're looking for. There you go. Yeah, 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 that's it. All right. Rest of the sounds you need are spread across the city. I left a few messages for you, too, to help you get a feel for each location. Oh, dope. Mm. Not now. Hey, get some you like? Yeah, really unique dynamics. See? Old man still knows his stuff. And you were right about clearing my head, too. I know what to do about Finn. I gotta see her. Try to talk her out of all this. In person? Where? Trinity Church. Tomorrow night. Why so interested? Because you got a target on your back the size of Jersey. You don't have to protect me. Someone should. You know, you said you never finished this tape because of how things went bad between you and Dad. What actually happened between you two? It was complicated. We were too similar and too different. <sighs> Finish the tape, get all the samples, and you'll hear the whole story. Promise. All right. Thanks, Unc. Trinity Church. Remember, the tinker is yours, but leave the boy alone. Let's set us up. Not cool. Man, I needed that. I was beat. Okay, I'm gonna call Finn as soon as I'm ready to go.
Dude looks super futuristic. Talk to Gloria about Feast as me, not Spider Man. Undercover by not being. Hey, Gloria. Undercover. What's going on? Why is everyone outside? A pipe burst. We cleaned it up, but the city won't let us reopen till the plumbing's fixed. I've had it repaired three times, but it keeps breaking down. Can you send people to other Feast shelters? They're at capacity. Everyone here, they've got nowhere else to go. We're trying to keep people warm and fed, but in this weather... Anything I can do to help? Yeah, actually. Could you check on the people camped in the park? They don't always open up to management. Happy to. Then get back to your vacation. You work too hard. Yeah, yeah. Check to see how we can help these guys. Not a fan of camping? I'll get that. Thank you. I'm Steph, Gloria's girlfriend. I'm volunteering at Feast. Or what's left of it. Yeah. Gloria said the city won't reopen the building. They're being unusually stubborn. And they showed up so fast to condemn us, less than an hour after the flood. Uh, I sound like I should be wearing a, a tinfoil hat, huh? No, that's weird. Well, listen. Thanks for your help. Okay, suspicious. I should keep talking to people. Maybe I can fix this. What's in here? Bricks? <clears throat> here. Blankets. I got you. Food. Thanks, man. Heavy food. I'm trying to keep this yeah, stuff well, dry. If you set it down in the snow, it's so get worried even get robbed. And then so the flood happened. up like a sponge. I even Don't brought even a knife. What icky crap is in that Why cell? did you Typhoid think that? Thought some guys chasing the, the place. Chased them off, but they just came back. Then they up and disappeared right before the flood. Huh. Well. Let me know if you need anything else. Be careful with that knife. Can do. Thanks. Did you come up north? With the flood? Pipes are old. Hey there. Did I overhear you talking about someone from the city? Yeah. About a month ago. Shelter put in a new water heater. Inspector came by. He said we were in good shape. Then all this went down. Yeah. You'd think he'd catch that. I gotta run. Stay warm. You suspicious. Too. Lots of suspicious stuff happening. Hey, you busy? Working on speed nonagon. What'd you find? Guys were casing feast right before it flooded. The city swooped in like suspiciously fast to condemn the building. And an inspector said the pipes were fine right before one burst. You think sabotage? Definitely. I need to change into my suit. Spider-Man to the rescue. He was undercover by being undercover. Gloria said the city will reopen the shelter if the pipes are fixed. Let's see if I can pull it off. Leads to a storm drain. Clogged by... Ugh, crash. No wonder the pipe burst. Clear the trash. I don't think the water's running. Oh, I know how to fix it. You gotta find the pump station. How do you know that? I did a clean up the rivers project in fourth grade. So they're sparkling clean now? Well, cleaner. Do not go in the Hudson. That's disgusting. <laughs> He did a freaking project in fourth grade and he knows how to fix it. What? Yankee. These are definitely the guys I bought at the power station. 
Okay, I get the bank heist and the power station, but why mess with the beast? Let's find out. You think he'll start running protection again? Yeah, once he's settled in, sure. Gone. She's got to turn on the pump. The pump. Hey, clean up the rivers, guy. Pump's pressure is in the red. Looks like they messed with the valves. You'll have to reset them individually before you can turn on the pump. Did you hear those guys? Their boss wants to run crime in Harlem. Drugs, protection. Ugh, can't people just visit for the food and museums and not make a mess? Non-Spider-Man related question. Have you started Jane Eyre for Miss Maller's class? I have pulled that dog. Behind track. Oh no. I'm not sure how I did that, but I exploded with electricity. Two to go. I'm back. We were talking about winter break reading. It's wild. I just finished this wedding. Hang on a sec. Found a bell. This one's <laughs> probably means it's old. Oh, grab, oh, grab, oh, grab. Ah, I gotta web it. That's two. One more, and I can turn the water back on. All right, all right. Hey, sorry. Aside reading, go. Let me make sure it was that high. I just finished this wedding scene. It... Oh, can't put it down. Are you reading right now? I thought you were helping me. Uh, yep, nope, I'm, I'm here. You have my undivided attention. As soon as I finish this chapter, five minutes. Oh. Beat on the game. Hey, guys. Tell me who your boss is? No? Okay, fine. There's no concern, you Spider-Man. This here's a private business. You're all gone. Now for the pressure valve. So easy. Should be fixed. I need to turn on the water at the pump station. Hey, Genki. Can you call the city? Get him to send someone to Feast North and declare it uncondemned. One official sounding call from a high school student pretending to be an adult, coming up. All right, let's go. Let's go. Rescue these people in the return oh. of the goon squad. Goon you squad. Get, rid of these guys. Okay, get out of here. Nap time, bro. Oh. Like in a cell? They don't let people visit. I, I almost messed everything up. Almost. That almost is not 100%. Whoa! Got a guy down over here! That'll leave a mark. These guys are probably like, what is happening? Hey man, it just overheard. Your boss is in the raft. Oh, whoa. Right side? Maybe we can cut off however he's communicating with people on the outside. I'll look into it. Now we gotta turn on the water. Oh, a little 360 over there. Water coming on. Now. Great timing. The city inspector just got the beast. Should be able to reopen soon. Cool. 
I'm gonna head there and make sure Gloria's got everything she needs. So, reasons for the boss of this whole shady operation to go after Beast. One, the land it's on, prime real estate. Two, having a shelter in Harlem reduces crime, like, a lot. And if he wants to be a crime boss, he actually needs crime to boss around. Exactly. But we stopped him. Go team! Go team! Hey there! Oh, Spider-Man. Hi. Always happy to meet one of you guys. Oh, uh, <clears throat> Yeah, listen, I was fixing the water system, and I noticed your shelter was affected. Should be fixed now, though. That was you? Inspector just came by, said we're good to open. Everyone can go inside. Ah, oh, Spider-Man, you've got perfect timing. Don't know how much longer we would have held out. Thank you. Hey, Gloria, it's Miles. I heard Feast North is open again. We had a little help. Spider-Man, if you can believe it. Thanks for stopping by. People in the park said you helped a lot. Happy to. Now get back to your winter break. We'll see you when school starts back up. All right. Bye. A little did she know that we're the same person. Hey, I've been talking to a local street artist named Haley. She has a lead on where this whole bad guy Harlem takeover operation is set up. That's awesome. Where can I find her? She's super busy helping plan the King's Day Parade, but I'll post in the app as soon as she's free. Oh, you've met her. Before the rally, remember? Street artist, uses sign language. Oh, yeah. She's cool. Hmm. I'll look up for your post. Cool. Talk. We'll do this one. All right. Time to call Finn. Hope she answers. Hi, Spider-Man. Finn, hey, we need to talk. In person. So you can lie to me again? So I can make this right. Please. Meet me at Trinity Church. No more lies. I promise. If you're screwing with me... Fine. I'll see you there. At least she's willing to meet. Okay, Trinity Church. Let's go. Dad and I fell asleep listening to this sound every night when we were kids. It's got a good beat. Okay. Something rhythmic that was around when Dad and Uncle Aaron were with us. I think it's back there. Behind me. Keep moving. Keep moving. Do the hand thing. Go down. Nope. I asked for you for Christmas, Spider Man. Where were you? Maybe something mechanical? <laughs> the cold is brutal. Definitely the not this way. Nah, getting too far away. It has to be train station. Subway line near here. You're a lot smoother than I thought. Game's almost on. Yeah, you think the subway line is here? Hello? Hey, dude. Okay, well. It's not supposed to be about Ujima. Not the pub crawl. Come on, it's right. really him. Hey, Spider Man. Oh my god. So 
I'm the nice girl. Hey, drink a pole. Too far. For the train to come by, get close enough to record it. He doesn't really have a beat we could use. I'm not gonna find it over here. Spider Man. No. Happy Hanukkah. We'll wait for the train to come by. Yes. There we go. That was hard. Wow. Not far from here. Before we moved to Brooklyn in high school. Hearing the clatter of the wheels. Squealing when the trains turn or stop. Always makes me think of me and your dad's late night talks. Mostly about what we wanted to be when we grew up. I wanted to be a space alien. Your dad's dream changed. Doctor, firefighter, social worker. But he always wanted to help people. Yeah, sounds like dad. Does sound like dad. Old dad. Wow, this is far away. Get this thing actually. Hello, friends. This is the Danicast of our debate. And that's your intro? Lame. We in the business call that burying the lead. Almost done with this. It up. Let me ask you something. Danny, do you ever think about what you're inciting? About your journalistic integrity? More than some. Because your campaign against Roxxon is baffling to an actual journalist like myself. You should be attacking the young, unproved vigilante who keeps causing problems in Harlem. What? You, you twist everything Spider-Man does into something malicious while simultaneously excusing everything Roxxon does wrong. All Spider-Man needs for you to support him is to get a better PR department. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. The only problem Spider-Man fixes are the ones he causes. I won't praise the arsonist for putting out his fire. Meanwhile, Roxxon built a beautiful plaza in a failing neighborhood. By tearing down homes and businesses, our new Spider-Man is proving that Harlem isn't the failure Roxxon makes it out to be. And you, Mr. Jameson, for someone who claims to love New York, you sure do seem to hate New Yorkers. You are clearly emotional, young lady. So I'm invoking the mercy rule on this debate. Jared, shut it down. And whose idea was it to debate a teenager? There are no good objects to destroying a child. Get the car. I need a hot stone massage. Hello? Hello? Uh, yeah. Well, thanks for the debate that you demanded, Mr. Jameson. To everyone else, remember to stand up every half hour while working at a computer. Bye. That was uh interesting. It was a conversation. We're gonna do this. Awesome. Look at this suit. This is incredible. All right. Let's go. This. Pinker Taylor Spider Spy.